Dear Maria, there are three things I want you to know. These things are not contingent upon the weather or the state of the stock market. They will always be true and honest. Number one, you will always have my love and attention. First and foremost, above all, other people and things. When you call, I will be there for you. Number two, I will always pursue a relationship with you and God together. Our faith is what yokes us together, strongest of all. I have faith in you, and especially in the God that made you. I will always strive to be the best version of myself for both our sakes. Our life together may not always feel magical, but it's far better doing life together. I'm a better me for loving you. I love you so much, and I look forward to seeing you at the end of the aisle. Your soon-to-be husband, Andrew. My sweet soon-to-be husband, the days and the journey that have brought us to this moment, this day, have been filled with joy, with hardships, with laughter and tears. I feel equipped and prepared for whatever lies ahead. I've been writing to you for years, maybe even decades, praying that the Lord would be preparing you and preparing me. When I read back through this chest of letters, I see a miracle He's creating in our union. I see answered prayers which, with each day, getting closer to today. Andrew. You are gentle, patient, kind, funny, and serving, and I can't wait to be your wife. You ground me and bring me a balance to my life that I've spent a long time searching for. I promise to love you for all of my days, to always pursue Christ, and to work towards and forever or for our marriage and family. I love you. See you soon. Maria Pistone. So it is by the authority given to me as a minister of the Church of Jesus Christ that I now declare that Andrew and Marie are husband and wife, according to the ordinance of God and the laws of the state, indeed in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, whom God has joined together, let no one separate. Good, good day.